Made it to the pier to head to Kapangan, and man, I just found out the worst news that you could possibly find out on the trip. So, guys, today is our last thing called Samui. We just arrived to a bagel place. It's low key sad because all of us, you know, have to say goodbye to my nigga. Chicky love. Oh, Courtney Thomas, 7 a.m. Oh, so, so, wow. 7 a.m. Yeah. 7 p.m. I'm sharing with you. I'm about to say 7 a.m.? You leaving tomorrow? I slept. I slept. Yeah. Difficult to eat. Bro. Yes, yes. Perfect. I haven't tasted by yet. I just had an instant with my girlfriend. It takes half off this. I need this. So yeah, I gotta lock my arms. You gotta lock my arms. Okay? Yeah. Let's go. What is this good? Oh no. See what you're doing. It's like they've known each other forever. This is their first trip. Wow. This yeah. is crazy. Everybody's so close now. Oh, this is so sweet. Yeah. We're all saying goodbye to Manita. So sad. I'm sorry, so so. One trooper down. <laughs> Take care. So she wants to go start, man. You didn't even get to get your seafood here. Mm. Your oysters. Oh, I get you. Oh, you're gonna go? You're gonna get salmon. No. Okay, oh, you're gonna get salmon. <laughs> Bring it all in. Oh, oh. Have fun. Okay. Let me know when you leave and when you make it to like the pier. All right? Oh, you got to do the same thing. You got to do the same thing we just did. Okay? Um, One, two, three. <laughs> Ready? Hey. We got two French speakers right here. They, they both speak French. And I'm putting yeah, them to the right. test by playing a French song that I have put on my IG post. So, so y'all gotta tell me exactly what he said. Don't make up no BS because I'm gonna see if y'all know it. Yeah. Not that part, just wait. The chorus. Uh -oh. Okay. No, what he said, like, there was. I don't know what he's Oh was man. There's a lot of slang words like disagree, man. There was a lyric that was like, you don't even speak French. Come on, that should be enough now. Come on now. But it's slang words. Oh, I thought y'all was like, y'all was deep down in France, man. I thought y'all know the language like that. She's really good. They're both good and with French. So I give them that. They can understand it. You not good with French? Let's have a conversation with Floyd. Yeah, 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 she yeah, speaks yeah. speak really good French. Try to definitely have a conversation. Definitely have a conversation. Okay, good. Okay. Oh, ça va et toi? Oh, ça va, ça va bien. Ça va bien. Je veux. Qu'est-ce que tu vas faire aujourd'hui? Allez, j'ai moi. Je veux aller avec toi. Non, 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 Oh, check name? up, check up. Cop, come on, cop. That's us. That's us. No, 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 no. Come on, guys. We have to all get a group plug in. A group hug. Be safe, tell me. Say, tell me. Say, my B. Shut up, Bikadi. Oh, my. 500 each up with the speed boss. See? See you. I fed you, I fed you. Mama, 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 mama. He's like, what you doing, bro? <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> He's like, there ain't enough room for that in my car, bro. Oh, he just closed the door. Bye, 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 bye. 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 Bye, 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 b
man. See you. See you. <laughs> we just made it to the pier to head to Kapangan. And man, I just found out the worst news that you could possibly find out on a trip while vacationing. And that's my auntie passed away. So, you know, that was tough news to hear. She's very close, pillar in our family, immediate as well. Unfortunately, I don't know if I'll be able to go to the funeral. My mom's really sad. She called me early, early this morning. She called me and said it was, she was unresponsive and they was gonna fly her up there to go check her out because it's not looking good. 45 minutes from when she called me, my auntie passed and she called me back. I missed the phone call. And then everybody's all at my uh, family's house in Orlando. But my auntie that passed away, she's in Kansas. So everybody's gonna try to go up there to Kansas to see her. Um, they haven't decided the funeral details yet. But yeah, it's tough news, man. I'm gonna try to stay in good spirits because I do have my friend and his girl here and my other friend here. So, you know, gotta kind of stay positive through it all, but grieving at the same time. But don't judge me if it makes you seem like I'm having a good time, but I'm actually gonna be still dealing with this you know, in between. So yeah, I just wanna update y'all, you know, life happens in between like you having fun and enjoying it. You know, things can't happen. And this is a prime example of that, so. And that's something I didn't want to happen while I'm going away. She's like a, a scare risk for me coming to Thailand because she was always pretty sick. Um, and I didn't want anything to happen to her while I was away. And now it's a year, I, I was like, okay, I've been away, home from, away from home for a year and nothing happened. So we can definitely do one more year. But fortunately, we didn't make it to that point. Chloe, Chloe found her pet cat. Yeah, I found a new baby. Him? You want to take him back to Shima? Adopted. You good back there? Yeah. As we hopping on. We hopping, we're going to Kopangan right now. <laughs> we lie, man. Yeah, Pangan, here we come. Here we come. Here we come. Hey, here we go. <laughs> we about to hop on a speedboat. We're going to figure out which one we're hopping on. Okay. How are you feeling? Excited? I just want to be jumped up and down. I know. Are oh, you definitely going to get that experience on here? Absolutely. Okay. Oh, oh. Everybody's lit. Sit down. Yeah. This is the left over here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you are bad. You can leave it. And now that's it. Thank you. Oh, snap. Cardi! <laughs> Shall I be in Cardi? Two minutes, three minutes, go to the end of And then we're going to the end of the day. Shall I be in Cardi? What are you doing now? We're on our way. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. 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 let us you know, 1,100 baht to, you know, Holy it's we've taken two ferries already. Now we got to take three more um, from here to Kortau, which is in two days. Uh, and then from Kortau to Pangan, which is for the full moon party for one night. We're not even going to stay in anywhere from Pangan. We're just going there like at 5 p.m. Uh, we're leaving at 5 p.m. and then we get there at like 6.30. And then we take in one more ferry, which is to get all the way back to Suratani and then take a taxi to the airport. So we had to pay for all those in advance right now. Okay. 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 All right, we got it down to 100 baht. <laughs> On the move, man. Oh, we got some shirts in there. Oh, yeah. We got some shots in there. What is your name? D'Angelo. Dad, because of the speedboat. Really? Like, yeah, I, like, I feel like I wanted to feel. Oh, right man. Now. I didn't even know. You, you seem like you was taking it like a champ. <laughs> <laughs> you have the viewpoint all the way up here. It's pretty much the island, whole island of Kopangan. Yeah, I think it's. Yeah, I checked in yesterday at like half twelve. Yeah, so. 
Oh, okay, so everybody, yeah, so we should be able to. just do it as the housekeeping goes, so just, I mean, if you're here, okay. I'll just try to get you in first. Makes sense, thank you, man. Oh, uh, yeah, that was supposed to be. Good, we didn't spend that much time, only a day, yeah. so. I've heard that was more like, uh, resorts and stuff. Yeah, yeah. beach clubs right back to back. Very touristy area. Yeah. 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 Like, part here. Yeah, yeah. Stuff. Very crowded, very neat. Yeah. But we did a lot in the one day that we had. Yeah, how long were we here for? Uh, two nights, and then we're going to go to Kotao. Yeah, we're gonna go tomorrow as well. You like it? Yeah. Hotel seems like the best place, eh? Okay, see? Yeah. Okay. That's what Chloe, look at yeah. Chloe. I ain't know, because it was a little, it was a little, <laughs> it was a little small. I'm like, ah. Oh. Kieran. Kieran? Yeah? Nice to meet you, Kieran. What's your name? Uh, Dila. Dila. Yeah. Vian. Yeah. Uh, we are gonna check another room, the same room, so if it's ready, we will check you in Thank early. You so much. Okay. Yeah, we are to check now. This is the free water you're talking about? Yeah. Okay. So now I'm getting cold though. Oh, Chloe had her bottle, that's why. This is what really sold me, man. The setup out here. Yeah, it's real good. And actually, not too bad price. I don't know what type of room we're um, I think we were like in a hostel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Room, yeah. It was like yeah. all four of us are staying in the same room with maybe 800 people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look yeah, yeah, exactly. at all the scenes. Wow. The ancient this, uh, instruments, people are dancing. Really? Yeah, yeah. On the beach and acro yoga on the side. Oh, that's my vibe right there. Yeah, it's so good. Because I'll tell you, every Sunday people need to go to them. Did they, did they come here? Or we have to book it ourselves. Yeah, yeah, yourself. We but we, we have taxi service, so you can just scan one QR code. Right. You tell them from here, there, how much, uh, get, uh, how many people. Okay. But it's better to rent bike. Oh, we can't ride bikes. Hour. We're not allowed to ride bikes. Mm. We're teachers here, so they will come. Our, our organization doesn't allow us to ride bikes. What's this organization? <laughs> <laughs> it's sacred. It's, it's, like, it's the US government, so it's like. Fucking we, US government <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> Even in, on a tropical island. Wait, for real? Like, yeah. Why you said it's so hot? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. It's decent. We have a cool water, Thank you, brother. Okay. Nice. We're getting a little tour of the, the spot. Oh man. Do you need a hand? You guys good? Oh no, we good, bro. Appreciate it. Whoa. So I guess we got a, a dorm of like 14 people. This the men showers over here. It's for a woman. Dang. So I just Bit of a mess. Yeah, choose, and I just need to know uh, the number. And if you need lockers, we have uh, near the the bin. Okay. Okay. The bin and the sink. Mm. So this is available. These four yes. are available. One is this way. That one's also available. It's available. So just choose and tell me the number, please. Can I do that one? This. Okay. I'll take the middle bottom one. We just take Five. this. Two. All right. Cool. These three. And then this one here. Gotcha. Yeah. All right. Sounds good. So this. Both this and this? Yes. Okay. 73, 74, and 18. Okay. Thank you, guys. Thank you. So we just left Wonderlust. It's like 4 p.m. We want to get something to eat. Whitey cop. Sea corn cop. Got some Indian food again, but it's mixed with Thai food, so that's great. I tried one here. Very different. Yeah? Very different. Tomato? Oh, cop, come on, cop. Wow. Look at this. Hey, y'all. Chloe took one of my fries, y'all. Guys, we just finished lunch, late dinner. Probably gonna eat again, but we're heading to Tong Sala Beach. We're in the roads of Koh Phangan. I'm with everybody. The game. We're just talking about, all of us are actually teachers. The, it's funny enough, y'all may think, oh, we just partying. We just like wasting time living lavish now nah, we're actually teachers we're just enjoying our time because we all got to go back to school soon after midterm which is honestly soon yeah fellow fellow 
Okay, as we walk in the trail, we're one minute out from the beach. Tong Sala Beach to be exact. On the quiet beach. On the quiet beach. The most reasonably placed beach of all in Kaw Fucking Gan. Yo, hey man. We got a pet dog that followed us from the restaurant. He almost got hit. We can't let him get yeah, he's our pet now. We gotta look after him. Oh, I, I, we got you, man. I think that's that may be Samui. Yeah, all of them are very close. As we get closer to full moon party, I think we will see more people, but I don't think you will see many people in this area anyway because it's not much water. But yeah, see, even those people are standing all the way out there. They're standing up. It's just wild. Super low tide. I'm like chilling out here. I like this area. Yeah. <laughs> nah, this is a fire show. Oh yeah, I didn't even bring a towel. I guess we'll dry off by the time we walk back a little. So guys, yeah, today... Yeah, it's been a rough one, mixed emotions of, you know, trying to stay positive, enjoy my vacation because you can't really expect death to happen in your family. Um, it's just very unfortunate, man, that I low-key feel bad of like even even recording but like this is my way of grieving because i can't like i can't grieve my family I and mean, that's something i like i'm mad about right now um and i pray that no more deaths happen until i get back but that's the unfortunate part that not many people talk about or you know there's risk of staying far away from home a lot of the times of moving abroad um maybe we can't get home in time or maybe can't in my case go home at all you know it's something that um I didn't really expect you know you hear it you prepare for it because I signed up for it I'm not saying I'm not blaming anybody I signed up to be a Peace Corps volunteer um, I knew the risks that were involved here but I was leaving home for two years knowing I have family members of older age who are prone to getting sick you know that's a possibility of it happening so I had to really accept that man I took my moments where you know I was away from just processing everything myself or even on the way to the island. Having moments where I just pray and sit in silence. That's my way of, you know, having to deal with this and other than like calling moms or checking in and see how the family's doing, which I know they're probably not doing great. Um, but I hate that I, you know, in a sense living my best life while my family's not particularly living their best life in this moment. My auntie is in better hands now. She's, even if I was there, there was nothing that I could do to change the situation, make anybody feel better. Like everybody's still gonna grieve and process their own way. Um, and now I gotta grieve and process my own way and know that everything's gonna be okay. My auntie's gone. Um, and knowing her, she probably wouldn't even want me to come back and <laughs> worry about her knowing that she's you know up with the maker that's just like the her personality but if i had it my way i would be that back no matter how she would have reacted because she means so much to me and this video is dedicated to her um i love you auntie you impacted the lives of everybody you came in contact with whether it was to you know just being honest brutally honest comedic you know a motherly figure you know, wherever, whenever people came to your house, they had a food to eat. They can always take away something from your house because you always had so much stuff. Like it was its own grocery store. You were the brightest light that anybody could ever come in contact with. And that's something I'll remember for the rest of my life. It pains me, man. And it really sucks. But I'm not able to be with my family. But God is good through it all. That's all I can really say. It just reminds me that life is so precious that anything can happen to any one of us at any moment. I'm not exempt because I'm in a different country. And life doesn't pause just because I'm away from family and nobody's gonna stay and wait on me if, you know, 
to make a call them home if their time is up. Like, there's moments I knew that I was going to miss. I pray that anybody who's watching this, I pray that your family, your loved ones are protected. They stay healthy. I pray for prosperity. I pray for peace. I pray that you're able and you take every moment to love them, to cherish them, and to tell them those things and how much you do because life can be taken at any moment and we don't know the hour nor the day. When our name is called and when the person that we love the most name is called, pray for restoration, for prosperity, for patience. I pray for endurance during hard times. For anybody who's going through that under the sound of my voice, no matter what you're going through, what you're facing, it too shall pass. Lord, I thank you. Amen.